Hello guys and welcome to my channel. Today I am back here with yet another unboxing video of this Corsair H60 CPU cooler. As you know guys, I have been doing a lot of unboxing on my channel these days so as to create an ultimate astrophotography image processing rig so as to have an enough image processing power to reduce your image processing session for your astrophotography. So guys, if you have not watched those videos, I will put the link of those videos above or in the description below for you guys to check it out. So guys, ensure that you watch this video till the end so that you do not miss out on any important information or specifications that I have to share. So before we move further guys, if you are new to my channel and not yet subscribed to my channel, please hit that subscribe button and click that bell notification icon so that you get the notifications for all my new videos. Let's get started. So guys, before we move further with unboxing this and seeing the content inside, let us see what is there on the top of the box and what are the specifications or information which is present on the box. So as you can see guys, this is Corsair H60 high performance 120mm liquid CPU cooler. So guys, on my channel before I have already done a Mirage 5 CPU cooler unboxing as well. If you have not seen that video, I will put the link of the video above for you guys to check it out. So let's proceed with unboxing this and see what are the details available on this box so this is an hydro series this is a liquid cpu cooler as you can see guys this is a single fan cpu cooler made by Corsair. the size of this fan on the cpu cooler is 120 mm this has a five year warranty the fan speed is pwm controlled so depending upon how hot your cpu is the speed of the fan can be controlled the size of the radiator is 120 mm so is the size of the fan as well so this is compatible with any of the cabinet that you have which normally supports 120 mm uh, fan the white LED lit pump head top of the CPU this is the lid that is going to transmit the heat to the radiator this has a white lighting this is not an RGB controlled white light so it is only be a fixed light lit CPU cooler so that is what it is there on the top of the box it is hydro series so this is going to be a liquid cooled CPU cooler now let us see on the side of the box what it has to offer on the side of the box, as you can see, this is made by Corsair. It, this is liquid cooled CPU, so cooler is quieter and more controlled. The Hydro Series H60 is an all-in-one liquid CPU cooler with a 120mm radiator built for a low noise and liquid CPU cooling and bold styling with a white light LED lit pump head. So the pump on the top, like I told you before, it's not an RGB control. It is just a fixed constant white light lit. On the side, it also says it is made by Corsair. This is SP series PWM fan, 120mm radiator, white LED lit pump head. That is what it says. So with the photographs and it has a high performance 120mm liquid CPU cooler, that is what it informs let us see on the other side what it says it has nothing more than the logo and the branding so that is what is there now let us see at the bottom what information does it has it is made by Corsair its compatibility is socket uh, which it supports is LGA 1100 1151 1155 1156 1366 2011 2011 3 2066 these are all for Intel's now for AMD the socket compatibility is AM2 AM3, AM4, FM1 and FM2. The processors which it is compatible with is Intel Celeron Pentium Core i3, i5, i7 for AMD. It is AMD Athlon 64, Optron, uh, Simpron, Phenom, Phenom 2, Athlon 2, Optron, 138x a series ryzen 3 ryzen 5 and ryzen 7 as you know guys i have ryzen 5 so i think and my motherboard supports am4 socket so i think this cpu cooler is compatible with my processor as well as my motherboard in the box the contents that you will find is hydro series h60 performance liquid cpu cooler sp120 pwm high performance fan mounting brackets hardware and quick starter guide so these are the contents inside this 
box now let us see at the back what information does it provide so it comes with an uh, branding of Corsair this model number is H60 so the experience lower CPU temperatures with a 120 mm high density slim radiator for maximum cooling surface area and performance so this is the radiator size as you can see this is 120 mm it has a thickness of 27 mm with the fan to, uh, the thickness increases to 25 mm more and the width of this is 157 mm so it is compatible with any of your cabinet which can take 120 mm fan here you can see in hydro series h60 the noise level is around 28.3 decibels average air cooler fan noise is 36 decibels so let us go through some of the technical specifications that it says so the radiator dimension is 157 mm to 120 mm to 27 mm the fan dimension is 120 mm 120 mm and 25 mm the fan speed is 600 to 1700 rpm the fan airflow is 57.2 cfm the fan pressure is 2.08 mm of h2o the fan noise level is 28.3 tba so guys these are all the information which is present on the top of the box now let us open the box and see the contents inside let's open it so once you first open the box you can see on the top you have the safety and warranty guide and also the user manual this will contain the warranty information and also the quick starter guide will contain all the information on how to install the cpu cooler as you know guys i'll be doing another video on how to install the cpu cooler onto your cpu onto your motherboard so ensure that guys you stay tuned to my channel so that you do not miss out on my future videos for now i will keep the documentation aside so on the top you can see it is covered with the foam cover so as to protect your equipment inside during the transit so let us remove the foam cover from the top as you can see there are a lot of contents inside let us remove one by one and see what these things are so this is the fan uh, radiator fan that it comes with let's keep the fan aside So you can see this is the pump with the radiator that it comes with let's keep that outside as well and there are some of the brackets and the screws that it comes with so let's take that out as well so let us see what is else is there in the box so there is nothing more in the box so we'll keep the box aside so guys these are all the content which are available inside the box and we'll see one by one each one of them so as you can see guys these are the some of the screws or mounting screws that it comes with so as to mount your cpu cooler or cpu pump on top of your cpu so we'll keep the screws aside let us see the brackets that it comes with so it comes with two different types of bracket one for intel and one for amd so let's keep that aside too for now so this is the 120 mm cpu fan cooler which is going to be mounted on this radiator that it comes with so this is a 12 volt dc 0.3 ampere fan that it comes along with now let us open the main component and see as you can see guys this is the front side of the pump that it has so here will be the white lighting and the logo of Corsair that is going to glow when you uh, turn this on at the bottom it comes with pre-applied CPU paste so you don't have to touch it is being protected with this plastic so I'm gonna keep that in the same way this is the pump pipes that are going to flow the liquid out of this pump and take away the heat and cool it in this radiator now let us open the radiator so as you can see guys this is a metal radiator that it comes with this is a huge radiator with 157 mm width on top of this you will be mounting the fan so as to put the air pressure and cool all the heat that is generated and pumped by this pump from the cpu and these are the two lines one for inlet and one for outlet so as the liquid will be circulating from the pump onto the radiator to cool it down and then the cooled liquid will be pumped back to this 
pump to gather more heat so this is a big radiator which is going to be mounted onto your cabinet on top of it there will be a fan and the pump will be mounted over to your cpu as you can see guys this is the sata power cable that it comes with so as to power your pump and this is to power your light as you can see so these are the two connections that you would need and there will be a separate connection for powering the fan let me open the fan and show you guys how does it look like so you can see guys this is the 120 mm fan it has its own power supply so this will be connected to your cpu cooling fan power supply so ensure that you connect it to your cpu fan supply so as your motherboard can detect that it is connected if you connect it to any other power socket for supplying power to this fan your cpu will not boot up so ensure that you connect this in a proper way on your motherboard where it says that it has to be connected for cpu fan so this is your cpu fan socket where you connect this fan with so this is it guys uh, this is the content what you get inside this Corsair H60 liquid CPU cooler so guys I would recommend to use this liquid CPU cooler these are more efficient than tower or fan based cooler but this since this is a small radiator with one fan design only I would recommend to do a moderate overclocking of CPU with this kind of radiator if you are serious about CPU overclocking I would recommend to use at least two fan based or three fan based radiator liquid CPU cooler for dissipating higher heat which is generated by overclocking your CPU. So this is it guys this concludes the unboxing of this Corsair H60 liquid CPU cooler. I hope you guys like this video if you like this video do not forget to hit that like button. If you have any questions or comment, please leave them in the comment section below. I will try and answer as soon as possible. If you are new to my channel and not yet subscribed to my channel, please hit that subscribe button and click that bell notification icon so that you get the notifications for all my new videos. Thank you guys. Thanks for watching and clear skies.